Every year, thousands of consumers are conned into paying debts they don't really owe. It's called phantom debt, and in this Watching Your Wallet, consumer investigator Rachel DePompa talks to a federal agency about how you can avoid falling victim. The Federal Trade Commission's returned millions of dollars over the years to consumers duped by phantom debt. That's debt a scammer made up, tricked you into paying. You don't really owe anything. It happens to thousands of consumers each year. Somebody takes some information from the dark web about you, calls you on your phone and demands you pay up. Or maybe they pretend to be a collection agency or from the IRS. The Consumer Financial Protection Bureau and FTC have taken action against a number of players over the years. John McNamara with the CFPB says this behavior is absolutely criminal. You can spot it. The scammer asks you to pay a bill in an unusual way or in a rush demanding you pay. If you ask a scammer questions, they generally will hang the phone up immediately and they will go away. But again, they, they, any sort of rush for urgency to pay right away generated by a phone call should be met by the consumer with a high degree of suspicion. And it's okay, ask questions, ask them to put it in writing. Again, scammers will almost never do that. Always keep good records of past debt. If you're contacted by a credit collection agency, request a debt validation letter. Check your credit report regularly. And if you do have legitimate old debt, it's possible to negotiate with the debt collection agency and come up with a plan to pay it off. With this Watching Your Wallet, I'm Rachel DePompa.